welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is Chelsea welcome it feels like I haven't recorded and uploaded in a while because normally I like I like pre-record so the videos you see like the week of they're probably recorded like a week or two before so I, I think it's been like the last time I recorded was maybe like Thanksgiving or something. I don't know, it just feels like a really long time that I haven't talked to you guys and I miss it. Life has been kicking my butt with school and finals and stuff. So I'm just trying to get back into the swing of things, getting ready for the holiday season with our second holiday tutorial. Well, technically second, but it'll be the first for the month of December. I probably have like two more planned continue watching to see how i transform all right let's get to it since the eye look is mad simple and i'm not really worried about fallout or like sharp lines i'm gonna do my foundation first for primer i'm going in with my maybelline baby skin instant pore eraser primer i don't even know if they still sell this i'm just using what i have I'm gonna do a bit of color correcting because you know staying up late kicking on the phone studying has been getting to me so for color correcting I'm using my LA girl pro concealer in orange a little honestly goes like a long way Now that my color corrector is blended out, I'm going in with my Maybelline Superstay Foundation in 356 Warm Coconut. For highlighter, I'm going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in Toffee. Now that my highlighter is blended out, I'm going to set it with my Maybelline Loose Me Fit Powder in Medium Deep and then contour with my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Powder in Cocoa. But before I do my eyebrows, I'm gonna set my face with my L'Oreal Infallible Makeup Setting. Makeup is. I am going to set my face with my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Makeup Extender Setting Spray. For brows today, I'm going in with my Color Mates Brow Powder in Dark Brown. Brow Powder Duo. And to darken it, I'm going in with my Anastasia Dip Brow in Ebony. I'm going to do it off camera, so BRB. Starting off with the eyes, I'm going to prime them using my e.l.f. primer stick in neutral. Okay, going into my Morphe 350 palette, I'm taking this color right here and I'm gonna blend it into the transition area using a blending brush I think I want to go back into the palette and dip into this color right here to add like a bit more warmth to it because right now it's just looking cool I want it to pull a little bit like redder than what it's pulling All right, taking these two shades right here in the Morphe 350 palette, I'm going to blend the edges like right here so it doesn't look like it's harsh. Going back into the Morphe 350 palette, I'm taking the same color, this reddish color right here, and the same smudge or little brush, and I'm gonna smoke it out under the eye. Now that the overall like, 
look is basically done here we did the lid not the lid we did the transitionary crease under eye now it's time to pack on some sparkles on the lid and for that sparkles you already know we're going into the morphe 350 palette and we're taking this color right here this pinky color and we're gonna place her all over the lid This is not pink enough. When I envisioned this look, I was picturing pink and warm brown, pink and brown together with wing liner, soft lips, blase blase. So, BRB. So I'm gonna go into my 28 Essentials, I mean, Essential Eyes 28 Color Eyeshadow Palette by BH Cosmetics. This old raggedy thing. And I'm going to take a combination of these two pinks right here. And I'm going to place them on top so I can look pinker. Okay, for an inner corner highlight, I think I want to go in with the original color that I put on my lid from the Morphe 350 palette. So this color right here. Now that that's blended out to my liking, I am going to line my eyes. I'm going to do wing liner using my Milani Everlast liquid liner. Now it's time to curl my lashes and put on my mascara. Mascara for today is my CoverGirl So Lashy Lash Blast Pro. Yep. Okay, you guys, I'm back. This is the finished look and my outfit change. Um, As I was going through the last little bit of footage, I noticed that I was completely out of focus for like mascara, blush, highlight, lip portion, and setting spray portion of the video. So I like the finishing touches. So I'm gonna tell you what I use now. Mascara, CoverGirl So Lashy Blast Pro. Highlighter, Artist Couture Diamond Glow Powder in Conceited. You know, I went on ahead and put on some brow gel to set my brows in place and I used my Anastasia one. Set my face with this, my L'Oreal Makeup Stutter Setting Spray. For blush, I use my e.l.f. Blush Palette in Dark. I use this shade right here to make my cheeks a little rosy. And then for lips, I ended up using a ColourPop Ultra Glossy Lip in the color Playback. And this is her. Well, this is she. She is here. This is she. So, yeah. This is the finished look. I really do like it. This makeup look is for the girls who like makeup but don't really know how to do it. They know how to do, like, the basics. This is basic. It is perfect for a holiday party, for work, for school. It looks really nice and really simple, and I'm glad of how it turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Deuces.